things you wouldn't hear in a medical documentary. I know you're a teenage mother, but nobody will patronise you here. Come through to the slag ward. <laughs> <laughs> Next, he was put in a cat scanner. Unfortunately, the cat was still in it. <laughs> <laughs> And so Nick Griffin comes round after the face transplant, and that's not the colour he was expecting. <laughs> <laughs> OK, now cough and cough again. OK, yeah, I've got the diagnosis. Got a cough. <laughs> <laughs> Eventually, doctors had to break his leg in six places. It was the only way to stop him running round the ward, the little tosser. <laughs> 34% of people in this country have irritable bowel... Se oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> what this attractive patient doesn't realise is Dr Singh was struck off years ago. <laughs> <laughs> Brian is 75 stone. He hasn't left the house for three years. What a fat bastard. <laughs> <laughs> After months of tests, doctors finally discovered what had caused his blindness. He'd been masturbating too much. <laughs> Today we're attempting a slightly difficult operation. What we're hoping to do is remove the Adam's apple with a pair of tweezers without the patient's nose flashing red. <laughs> Tara removes her top to reveal a hideous skin infection. Look away now if you're eating Rice Krispies. <laughs> 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 the Siamese twins were joined in the most embarrassing place imaginable and known by friends as the skipping rope. 